Hello there, this is Matt from Space Coast Digital, and I am bringing to you today our first elegant restaurant funnel. Now, this is a one pager funnel, and it is one page because, for, for a very good reason, it's one page because uh, for restaurant funnels, what converts the best is one page funnels. And now, this reason is twofold. For one, Restaurants have a little bit of a different um, idea uh, when it comes to conversions. Restaurants only want reservations. Um, unlike other um, fields, um, restaurants really don't care too much about people browsing around and potentially seeing um, other products or something like that. They really want there to be a focus on the reservation, getting the person to make a reservation. Now, this funnel is definitely geared towards um, a sit-down restaurant. It doesn't have to be fine dining or anything, but definitely geared towards a restaurant that takes reservations, um, like something that uses Open Table or Yelp or uh, TripAdvisor or any of the platforms that you prefer. It doesn't matter. Now, I'm going to walk you through this funnel. And I'm going to show you what we've done here. We've taken a, a, a good amount of care um, because I myself uh, was once a chef. Before I got into digital marketing, I was a chef for many years. And my final job before I left the industry was uh, that of executive chef of a fine dining restaurant. And I ran their marketing. And so I have quite a bit of experience putting together something like this. And I can tell you that a, a website like this is super focused, simple, and beautiful for good reason, and that is why it is a one-pager. So these uh, navigation elements here will be leading uh, your customer to somewhere else here on the page. They'll be scrolling down to another section, but never leaving the page. And so that, that's the second reason in um, a restaurant funnel, you do not want the customer to get lost like you'll see on a lot of restaurant websites in galleries of many a hundred photos um, or on a personal blog of the chef or really anything else. You don't want them to be getting lost on a bunch of events pages. Like um, there's, I've seen many websites with um, calendars and things like that. And I'm not saying you can't use that, but if you're going to use that, you will definitely want to augment this page to include a calendar section on the one pager um, where in you will also definitely want to be having um, a button that's going to bring you right back to this reservation spot because you always want the, the customer to be making that reservation. That should be first and foremost in their mind because that's how restaurants make money. That's the only way restaurants make money uh, other than events. And we're also going to discuss that. So I have three different main sections on this one pager. And I believe that those are the three most effective uh, high converting sections for any restaurant page. This restaurant page is definitely um, about the pictures because that's what people want. They want to see the product. They want to know who's making it and they want to make that reservation. So we have a beautiful high definition picture to start. You can see we have our opt-in right here above the fold. This is an opt-in so you can get their email, start, start marketing to them um, every day or every week or every month, however often you want to do it. As well as once they click this button, not only are you going to get their information, but you're also going to be getting uh, forwarding them to your chosen uh, reservation site. In this case, it's going to open table. Um, you can always change that through the redirect override, um, which uh, I can easily help you set up if you reach out to me after you purchase the funnel. So let us go. So I have our first sec section of chefs. This goes right down to our meet the chef section. And um, that's me here. I'm Chef Matt. This is my friend, Chef Spring. And I didn't fill out any of these details. However, of course, because you will have your own details for your own chefs. Um, the reason we have this section in all of our funnels, you can always replace it if your chef is not uh, the interfacing type. Um, but it's good and people love to learn about and, and meet the chefs. Um, We'll continue going here. The magic of simplicity. You can see we're using really high definition, beautiful photos, and anybody can do this really um, with a pretty good camera. Um, I've even seen some photos come out this good with an iPhone. Um, 
So if you have good, good photos, great. If you don't have them, you'll want to get them so we can plug and play your own personal things. Of course, you're welcome to use everything on this page as it is all uh, licensed and ready to go. Now I have a section for the menu. You'll see at the top, this, this section starts here. And we are talking about the locally sourced seasonal specials. And if we continue down, we're going to see highlights from our actual menu. And these are all my dishes. Um, now, I, being a chef of quite a few years, I've been taking pictures of my food ever since I had an iPhone. And um, you'll see that here I've used um, an, a top-down view because it is very effective. And so I definitely highly suggest that when you are building out this funnel, after you purchased it, you're going to want to plug and play your own. I highly suggest doing uniform shots top down like this um, and cropping them so it looks like this because people love to see the entire dish. And people like simple and people like to see uniform. And so this is a great way to do that. And of course, you can um, you can take these sections here and duplicate them. You can put the entire, the entire menu on the page or you can do less, um, whatever you'd like. But this is set up for you to do to showcase your, your menu. And then, of course, like I said, we are geared towards reservations. So uh, here again, halfway down the page, you have a reservation, make a reservation tonight uh, button, which will scroll right back to the top so they can go ahead and do that. So getting back to it, now we're down to the events section. You see we're leaving off here. The events section is really the big money maker. Um, it, it is uh, one of the big money makers for a restaurant, the only other run money maker other than doing actual reservations. Is events because events are much higher margin due to uh, economies of scale and uh, restaurateurs will understand that one so um, here we just have a very simple but beautiful section where we can showcase some of our most beautiful event pictures for weddings special events corporate events social events wine tastings and corporate galas you can always add more of these if you like and i have a little note here for all event bookings please call us directly because every event is unique as everybody must know in the restaurant business, you need to talk to somebody on the phone about them. So they're going to call you instead of uh, making a reservation. And then, of course, at the bottom of the page, another reminder, please make a reservation tonight. And that will scroll to the top. And then, of course, we have our Google Map embed, um, which is set up for you. You'll, all you have to do is go in and change the address. And then right here, you'll, you have our little premium brand logo, which you'll replace with your own. And, of course, our information and, and ours, which again, you will replace with your own. And our little footer here, which you will replace with your own. This is a very plug and play, very simple funnel. I know that you wanna use a one pager, so you are focusing your customer on that reservation. Um, let's just scroll to the top so you can see it again. Beautiful front, beautiful middle, beautiful end, and everything is geared towards that one call to action, make a reservation. I hope that you purchase, and I, if you do, I believe that you will enjoy it, I hope that you do. and. Uh, you're absolutely welcome to reach out to me via the email in my profile um, if you need any help setting it up or getting started with your digital marketing. I wish you the best of luck and have a wonderful day.